Welcome to begin the sharmula for beef. What you're gonna want is a big bowl. Oh, that's like a beautiful this. bowl. Where is it coming from? Uh, it's coming from Fez, the city where our ancestors come from. Once you have your bowl, you wanna add three squeezed lemons, a cup and a half of olive oil, and then you'll want one tablespoon of ground cumin, one tablespoon of pepper, a tablespoon of paprika, a tablespoon of salt, some hot pepper flakes because we want it spicy, and uh, a couple kicks of cayenne. That's enough. <laughs> then we'll add our cilantro and parsley, and chopped red onions. After that, we take it all together, start to stir. If you want to do a fish marinade, it's essentially the same, except what we'll do is we'll start with some saffron and we're going to add some ginger, garlic, and preserved lemons. Preserved lemons, this brand Mina is from New York, but you should be able to find them in any good shop. And then we'll take some of the beef marinade, put it in here, and we'll have our fish marinade ready to go. So we have half of our charmula here that I'm gonna dump for the fish, and I will be saving the other half for the beef. Mixing everything, we should be able to have a beautiful charmula for the shrimp, and for our Atlantic cod. Bread in the oven for a few minutes. I am serving it like this in the baguette. And this is how we like it in the Shawi family. A nice bolochette in the baguette. My friends, bon appétit.